many different situations, field service jobs are part of a larger project, or various jobs need to be executed in a particular sequence in order to solve a customer on-site problem. Keeping track of service appointment dependencies can be a difficult task, and creating a work schedule that respects all those dependencies is challenging for any planner. We find use cases of job dependencies across various industries. For example, in the construction industry, a site survey is often needed before the construction can begin. In utilities, such as electricity and gas, an installation is oftentimes followed by a grid connection. And across various industries, we see upgrades of hardware or software that need to be followed by an end-user training. The complex work feature in FSL allows you to model a so-called chain of service appointments and schedule the jobs accordingly. In this list view, we can see that we have a couple of jobs to plan, all related to a solar panel installation work order. Three jobs are required to successfully complete this work. An on-site preparation that will take one hour and the actual solar panel installation itself that also includes the connection to the electrical grid. Obviously, the preparation work needs to be scheduled before the actual installation and connection work. Right now, we're looking at the solar panel installation service appointment, where we can see highlighted information across the top, detailed information in the main panel, as well as related information, all in a single screen. To set the dependencies, we will use the complex work feature. We define dependencies by selecting two service appointments and their dependency type. Looking at the available dependency types, it's clear that we need to schedule the installation job to start after the finish of the preparation. So we select our current installation service appointment to start after the finish of the preparation work. Note that it is easy to filter which service appointments are already or not yet part of the chain. Confirming the dependency saves it and gives us a nice visual indication of the linked appointments. From the same place, we can add a second dependency for the grid connection job. We will specify the installation work and the grid connection work to start at the same time. Confirming the second dependency completes the picture. Clicking into the details here gives us another view of the dependencies and also allows for easy correction of mistakes. Optionally, we can also indicate that the same service resource is required for linked service appointments. With the dependencies all set, we can schedule the complete chain of service appointments with just one click. While the scheduling engine goes to work, we get the scheduling feedback right on the spot. We get an overview of when each service appointment is scheduled and who the assigned resource is. Let's take a look at the dispatch console to see how our complex work chain is represented on the GAN chart. Here we see the different service appointments related to our solar panel installation, now in status scheduled we can easily locate the appointments in the GAN chart. Note the chain icon on the service appointment. This tells us that this appointment is part of a complex work chain. Clicking on the Show Related option gives us the same visual overview of the dependencies we saw earlier. The complex work feature in FSL gives planners the ability to easily set dependencies, schedule related service appointments in one click, and have full visibility at all times.